Hi, this is Tampa Tech, and learn something new from PC, TVs, and gaming too. Let's get it started. All right, now what you want to do is go in settings, click on settings, and then go to AirPlay. Click on AirPlay, and then turn on AirPlay. Just turn on AirPlay. So what you want to do is go to iTunes, and you want to update iTunes. So update iTunes right here. Check for updates. It has to be over 10.2 version. All right. So now once you, um, your computer boots you know down and um, restarts, you should have the new version of iTunes, and you should have this icon. If you don't have the icon, you might have to go in your settings, and preferences, which is right here. And then you want to go to I think it's this one I believe sharing and then you want to screen sharing and file sharing I believe maybe yeah I think that's so once you do that you want to go back and when you start iPhone um, iTunes when it click on that and you should have that icon if you don't have the icon you might have to go to apple.com forward slash forward slash support forward slash Apple TV there's a troubleshoot guide there but I click on Apple TV, all right, and then over here, click on that, click on movies, click on this, double click on that, and there, and there it is, right there, on the screen, just like that. And you can even use this to pause and play your iPhone. And if you want to control it with your iPhone, go to Remote Apple TV and um, download the app. You can use your phone to control the Apple TV. See, you hit menu. When you hit menu, it pulls up the menu, and you can just swipe. What is that little?